Okay guys, today I'm going to do a squat. Look at this Milwaukee power drill. Uh, 18 volt lithium ion battery. Uh, recently I had to replace my drill because it didn't work anymore. Bad day. So went to Home Depot, or yeah, Home Depot, and we sold this on sale, $99. Uh, battery was really small. I was used to nickel metal hydrant and my gosh, that is small. Drill is very light. And, and very compact, so I can easily get in more places than I could my other drills. I do like the light when you're drilling, so if you're in a dark area, it illuminates where you're trying to work. So this would work great in the, uh, the um, bilge of the boat when I'm trying to get into there. It will work great for putting that bilge pump in. But it has your drill, and your, your, your slow, low and high speed for drilling or uh, screwing or whatever. And then it has different tension settings all the way to drill. So your drill setting is gonna lock this so it, it won't click. And, uh, but if you're doing uh, a lot of screws, you may wanna set the tension so it tightens that screw to a certain point and it stops. But $99, Great product. The battery seems to last a long time. I've been uh, using the battery full charge. I have two batteries it came with. The charger will charge these batteries and a smaller type of battery. So that's really cool. And plus it charges these batteries up so fast. I, with the two batteries I have, I could be using this battery, run it dead, change out the battery, put the other one on the charger, start using the, the, the new battery, and the other battery would charge before I burn this battery up. So, really like that, because I've had projects where I've used two batteries and I had no more batteries because they didn't charge fast enough back in the nickel metal hydrate days. So, red drill, um, like it. It's light, compact. My wife can even use this. And, uh, Check it out Home Depot if you want one. That's my review of it. If you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this video, hit that like button. It's down there, looks like this. If you use this product, feel free to leave feedback down below. Y'all, please take care.